welcome to Jamaica Supermarket. This is like just another family shopping trip with uh, yeah. Michael. He's gonna lead us. He's gonna lead the way. In a lot of ways, it's just like everywhere else, except take a look at this. And Lydia, we found it. <laughs> Give us a tour. So this is the first time we've been in a supermarket here on the island. Right, this is the island where we stock up and make sure we're fully equipped. Come on this way. Come on. Let's take a look at these. These are the traditional uh, equipment that we need for Jamaica. And look down here, we have uh, the Jamaican rig. This is like 100 proof or, or you know, um, but we take it lightly. It's not mixed the same way as you would do back in the States. You need a lot of coke with this one. <laughs> Pepsi, whatever. Uh, rum cream, Jamaican rum cream. That's a nice, creamy uh, taste with, with rum inside. It's very nice, sweet tasting. Appleton must have some. I think we're gonna, we're actually gonna visit Appleton. Uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, estate, uh, and we're gonna see how they make this. Okay. This is brewed and made in Jamaica. Red stripe beer, and it's very. You've had some, and it tastes. Totally awesome. Dry beer, uh, no, no, very light aftertaste, but it's actually a very, very nice beer to drink. Dragon stud is well, actually, like, yeah, uh, dragon is, it's a mouth. Yeah, yeah. It's dark, dark, dark barley. Dark barley. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we need. It. Yeah, this one, this one, no, water. Yeah, this is a third quencher. We call it water. Jamaica right. <laughs> water. Turn the label over, so I can see. Water. Yeah. This is real Jamaican pepper. Scotch bonnet pepper. In a bottle. Yeah, you can take one, home as well. Fresh cut bonnet? Yeah, fresh cut bonnet. Yeah, bonnet. Yeah, bonnet. Yeah, bonnet. Okay, we need some scotch bonnet. <laughs> and it's called scotch bonnet because it looks like a cap from the, the Scottish the Scottish caps. And they would actually um, look like the, you know, ever seen the, the British yeah. Scottish cap? So they call it scotch bonnet. It's a habanero pepper. It is very hot, but not very, but it's flavorful. It's very flavorful. It's different than what the one you find in uh, Mexico. In Mexico yeah, Mexico. It's actually more flavorful. That one looks like so red it just came from the tree. Yeah, it actually turns different color, yellow and red. This is actually a green or a green version. Can you take a bite? No. <laughs> oh, there you go. That's a better uh, color. Right? How do you like to eat it? Usually chopped up in, in different food meats and things like that. Uh, but if you bite this. You're gonna be seriously impaired for a while, <laughs> right? And then you need a lot of water. That. Water. <laughs> yeah, you need a water. Yeah. Beautiful, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> this is our traditional salted cod. Way back when, Jamaica used to trade cod for rum. So for do you have the rum in here? This white rum. Jamaica's known for the white rum made from cane syrup, cane juice, and so we would get this for this. <laughs> they would take that back to England and the cod would be caught off of Nova Scotia and salted and everybody got used to it being salted to preserve it because there was no refrigerator. Right. It tastes well. And, yeah, so when we cook it up, we, we boil the salt out of it until it becomes, you know, less salty. And you make it with things like ackee. Ackee is uh, another native uh, vegetable that we eat here and we make ackee and salt fish. Are we going to be okay? cooking that with the kalaloo? With the kalaloo, you can, yeah. Kalaloo and salt fish works together well and it tastes really nice. Uh, this is almost like spinach, but it, it, we don't cook it as soft as spinach. It's actually more, uh, to me, it's more flavorful than spinach. There's a song they have when we bought some Jamaican cheese, and they say the bun and the cheese must go between. We actually cut the bun in between and go. It actually means some sexual connotation as they, you, the woman is the bun and the man is the cheese. They must go between. You get it? <laughs> <laughs> All right, and this is hard dough bread. Uh, it's it's more of a denser bread, okay. but it tastes really good. It's still soft. And we'll try this with, uh, we should have bought some other things, uh, guava jelly, but I don't know I if you think. Oh, oh, great, excellent. Right. If you're going to double them, let me show you everything we have. You see, it's very good, so. Everything shows up. It's not so easy. Scandal, you see. Because there was traditionally, <laughs> so traditionally, um, when, whenever, um, like say someone got kicked out of the house, they usually don't have no suitcase, so they would yeah. grab a bag yeah. and go run. And people say, hey, that kid just ran away from home. They see all their luggage in the bag. So they said, put the black bags, they can't tell what's going on. So you buy something, you have money, and nobody knows because it's all black. So all the bags are black to avoid scandal. 
Get it? Oh, scandal bag. Get it? And they got a Christmas tree in Jamaica. Because the, uh, the three kings haven't arrived yet.